I look different. That's because this is a re-upload. Enjoy. What's up, fam? Rough here, and we are back with more Thriller Bark, and more specifically, the final video for Thriller Bark. The final canon episodes of Thriller Bark. Yes, I'm aware that I should be watching the final one on my own. I know you guys said that it's a good filler to watch. And honestly, it's perfect because it's the last video I'm recording for the day. So I'm probably going to do it and then I'll probably just go watch. Uh, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll watch all three filler episodes just kind of on the couch hanging out. Uh, you know, I've been kind of wanting to just chill and watch some uh, One Piece, which is actually why I want to really start the manga. I have it back there and I'm just debating. Uh, I'm like, do I want to read along where I'm at? But I feel like I should start from the beginning. So yeah, but let's address the elephant in the room. Yes, I'm no longer sitting in Luffy chair Sama. Now here's the dealio. This is my job. I am sitting in this chair for a long, long time, eight, 10 hours a day. Sometimes I needed to invest in a chair that is actually good for my back. And so far after one day of using it, and this is day two, it's the first two days and months that my back has not been killing me after a day of recording. So that is why I got this chair, but I knew that you guys would not want Chair Samba to leave. So hopefully that looks good. I think I think it looks pretty good. I, I couldn't decide where to put it at first, and I feel like that's a pretty solid spot. I just gotta take the going merry that's over there and hide it. And now, if we get some like cool stuffed animals or something to the Amazon wish list or whatever, I could like put it on the chair and they could be waving and say hi. Maybe we could get a bunch and swap them out every video. I don't, do they have one? Is there One Piece plush toys? I need to know. Comments. Is there One Piece plush toys? Well, I mean, there must be. I have a chopper one, but he's little. Is there multiple One Piece plush toys? Let me know. But it is time. Honestly, it has gotten out of control. Like, it, everything was escalating, but then nothing happened. It was honestly kind of disappointing. I'm kind of surprised by it, mostly. But at the same time, we've always been confused by Soga King arriving. Weird things happen in One Piece all the time. I didn't expect nothing to happen at the end of Thriller Bark. I thought the end of Thriller Bark was going to be very hype, but nothing happened. But we are about to get very emotional. I think we're going to start learning a little bit more about Brooke and Laboon. Seeing Brooke cry was hard. I'm not going to lie. I've been in this habit where I've actually been watching the recap. Uh, I usually watch the recap of whatever video we're going to start right before I record. So I, I just as kind of a reminder, because sometimes I can't binge. I don't do it if I've reacted to a bunch in one day. But since this video was recorded, I think a day or two ago, I wanted the reminder. And God damn it, dude. I didn't cry or nothing, but like it, it really hit me in the feels. And I'm, and I'm like, I know I didn't record it because it, it wasn't, I've already seen it. We've already reacted to it. But One Piece really is magic. And I, and I really do feel myself getting more and more attached to the characters in the world of One Piece the more that I watch it. And it, it's funny, right? I, I, I already said that One Piece became my favorite anime when we hit Annie's Lobby. And I'm always telling people because I'm watching so many different kinds of anime. People are always like, oh, like, do you think that anything will ever pass One Piece? And I remember initially I was like, maybe, like I could see it happening. Especially when people were like dogging on Thriller Bark, you know what I mean? Like I was going in expecting, oh, like a Met arc after that. And I thought maybe my opinion would sway. And I was like, it'll probably move around as I finish certain arcs. But I feel like getting through Thriller Bark has solidified. I don't, I don't know if any anime will ever pass One Piece for me. Not like, I'm sure there'll be times where things will come out and I'll be like, oh yeah, like I think it had a better X over One Piece or whatever. And obviously I'll have criticisms of One Piece, but I don't know if any series will ever take its place because I'm so emotionally attached to the characters already. And we just have hundreds of episodes more. I, I don't, I can't, I can't imagine myself becoming less attached to the characters as time goes on. If anything, you would assume it would be the opposite. You'd get more attached. Could I see like me maybe having complaints about, you know, pacing or whatever, like people talk about, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure that it, at points that will happen and it'll be like, ah, oh, whatever. And then we'll get to a fucking hype moment and I'll forget and I won't care anymore. But I don't think that I'll ever fall out of love with One Piece. I don't think it's possible. I think I'm way too invested. So let's dive in. If you are invested on this journey with me, click the like button, subscribe, turn on the bell. It helps the channel, helps us grow, and helps get these videos to more people. And we can find more One Piece fans to come and hang out with. And if you want to talk with more One Piece fans, join our Discord. The One Piece chat is the most active chat. I, I guess not surprisingly. It's, it's you know, one of our biggest series and the one I've been doing the longest. So come join in, talk to the people in the community, talk to me, send us One Piece memes that aren't spoilers. And uh, let's dive in to episode 379. And remember, if you want it early, you can get it on Patreon, patreon.com slash rough senpai. We should be about three weeks over there ahead of YouTube and it's uncut. So go check it out. And if you don't have any money, you can get uncut clips on TikTok. I would do that on YouTube, but I just can't. But on TikTok, they're chilling. So go say what up. Let's go. That was really close. Holy shit. <laughs> it's been a long day. I'm closing it out with a chill One Piece video. What am I kidding? It's the end of an arc. This is not going to be a chill episode. 
So he was 38 when he died? Yep, see, he's the oldest one on the crew now. Even, even if you don't count the time since he's been dead. <laughs> Dude, that would suck. Could you imagine being waked up by that? <laughs> I mean, that's the one way to get somebody up. Oh my God, look at that boat. Oh, look how good it looks. Oh, and that's what got Laboon. Oh my God, he's so cute. Would y'all ever thought, would y'all ever thought that he would have been so teeny tiny? That was a wild noise. Right? Like, even pirates, how can you not think he's not adorable? Oh, they they named him, they fed him. He's part of the crew. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Is that? Panda, motherfucker, I saw you in the back. Man, Oda really has an obsession with panda bears. Laboon saved them. And they were so close. Oh my god, he's so tiny! Oh, that's a big motherfucking monster! Oh, Laboon! And they did. Damn, dude, he seemed like a really cool captain, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, that's funny. <laughs> I have to tell him to leave. Damn, it makes so much sense, though. Oh, they're just sailing away without the music. And they say whales never forget, dude. Laboon's proof of that. Oh, they're just going to ignore him. Oh, it's so fucking sad. My poor fucking Laboon. It's so different from like what I thought it was going to be. Like, I, th I thought it was going to be so different like... When, you know, Laboon was like, oh, wait here, we're going to come back for you. I thought it was like a mutual, like, you know, they, they departed on good part, like, good terms, I guess. I didn't, didn't expect this. Yeah. I have no idea what direction this is going to go in. But I'm nervous, bro. It, like, it almost got me, like, three times already. I feel like it's just a matter of time. Oda just knows how to get you in the feels. It, he really, really, really does. So something, something happened here, dude. Laboon must have followed them. I wonder how much time it was they spent with Laboon. Like, was it a few days, a week, a month? How did Laboon do it? He must have followed them. Damn, their boat is fucked. Yo, look at him. What? <laughs> I thought he was going to show up. Oh, that's where he got banged up at first. Laboon just did that shit on his own when he was that little. 
So this is more what I imagined. The fucking panda dude in the background. I see you, bro. Oh, now he has to have the serious talk. It makes sense, though. If Laboon would have went with them, he would have died. More than likely. Wait, what? Huh? Oh, here it is. They were really good pirates. And 50 years later, he's still waiting, bro. 50 fucking years he waited. It's like so sad, but it's so happy now that like, you know, we know like it, Laboon's gonna be so upset they're all dead, but like at least Brooke is gonna be able to see him again. Bro, when it, whatever I, I'm telling you, whatever episode that Brooke and Laboon meet each other again, I'm gonna fucking cry like a bitch. I already know. There's no, there's no way I'll be able to hold in tears when that happens. It's so fucking sad, man. Like, that's so fucked. Especially like. What if he didn't even want to come back? Like after something like that, would you would you even want to? Everybody that he knew pretty much is dead. I didn't really think about that until now. All right, let's see how depressed we're going to get. I'm going to guess like an 8-5 on a scale of 10. Maybe I'm wrong. I feel like we've probably made it past the really sad part, at least. I'm guessing. Oh no. So fucking sad. Like at that point, for real, would you even want to live? What the fuck? I guess it kind of makes sense, like... If you think about it, like, you sign up to be a pirate, like, yo, stray bullets are gonna happen. That's crazy how much they fucking dealt with, dude. Oh, he had a fucking bounty! Yo, what's his bounty, dude? Tell us what his bounty is, you motherfuckers. Tell us the fucking bounty! Oh, we're not gonna get to know. What? And this is what wiped them out, isn't it? Pretty sure that they probably mentioned it before. God, can you imagine being in that position? God, that would be so hard. Oh my god. God, that would be so fucking hard, dude. You would you wouldn't even have any way to know if he survived. Like Brooke probably has no idea. I fucking hope he survived, dude. And they meet him in like fucking 400 episodes or something. I mean, fuck it, let's meet him now. I don't care. I want Brooke to unite with somebody, and I know Laboon ain't happening anytime soon. <laughs> this makes so much sense! Oh my god, you would! You'd fucking lose it! You would- you would completely lose it after that long? Oh my god, this explains so much why he's like this. Like, bro, sometimes on my days off, I'm like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? And I have, like, a computer, video games, like, fucking TV. He has a fucking boat. 
An empty boat. It's the boat of memories. Oh no, he's hallucinating. Oh my god. Yo, this is so fucking sad. Oh my god. I have to say. Oh, and he got a fucking bounty when he was alive. Oh my god. Dude. This is this is one of these situations where 100% I it, it, these episodes would have broke me if they didn't keep interrupting the sad moments with happy moments. It's like it's helping keep my sanity. Every time I feel like I'm on the brink, they like do something funny or like, you know, a fun memory that like gets me to smile. Fucking chopper, dude. God, I hope they're able to help fix his face. He's got so beat up. What? What? あなたの生前の歌声。我々はああ、マイガード。ああ、ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです。ガードです
another year or two. Maybe in my time, Brooke. Well, actually, I guess I don't know. For all I know, it'll be fucking in an arc or two. I don't know. I would assume not. I, I have a feeling that it hasn't happened yet. Just because they're talking about looping the end of the Grand Line. So unless they loop the Grand Line before the end, that's the only way I can see it happening. But I, I'm pretty sure, like, if you loop the Grand Line, you'd probably have the One Piece, I would imagine. All right, 381. Let's hope that the, the tears are over. Uh, this, this being the actual finale, my assumption is yes. Yep, backstory's over. Probably won't be any more crying. Hopefully. I'm sure y'all are probably hoping for it, but you know. Literally. Literally. Not even not even metaphorically. I mean, yeah, metaphorically and literally. Damn. <laughs> I fucking can't. Chopper's so fucking cute. <laughs> He's so funny. You got a crew now, baby. You part of the crew. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> I fucking love Luffy. That was so so for reference, what I was talking about when I kind of got like a little like I didn't cry or anything, but like when I was saying that it kind of got me a little shook and up was when I was watching before we recorded, when I was watching the recap prior to was just Luffy and Brooke and just Luffy having like a serious conversation with him about Laboon. I don't know what it is. I think it's just because Luffy jokes around so much that like when I see Luffy get serious, it almost like makes me emotional. If that makes sense. I'm sure, I'm sure I'm not the only one that feels that way, but even this, like, just them talking is just so fucking emotional. <laughs> I think everybody is mostly. <laughs> Yo, they already talked about it. Like, this happened at the start of the arc. Yes. Now it's official. Wait, what? What the fuck? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, my fucking God. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what was this last three episodes, bro? Oh my Jesus. Laboon, we gotta find Laboon together. Oh my god, is there a Laboon figure? Oh God, I am so fucking excited for whatever is to come after this. One Piece just keeps getting better and better and better. Oh my god. He knows. He fucking knows. He knows. Oh my god. I'm a, it's gonna fucking get... I thought we were done with this! Stop. You're a dick. Not you, Laboon. They didn't know. Holy shit, let's go. And the Straw Hats bounties raise. Thank fuck, because the rest of them ain't getting any increases because the government's trying to cover it up. <laughs> Fucking 45 degree angle. <laughs> Oh my god, the crew just keeps growing. I wonder if Oda's done adding characters. Oh my god. 
Like I'm sure. I I, I guarantee. Like, well, I'm I'm gonna take that back. I'm not gonna say I guarantee it. But like, we know that it's not over. He's still writing it. He could totally add another person. That would suck if I'm not caught up by then. Because you guys already know, if if he did that and I wasn't caught up, I don't think it would be physically possible to avoid that spoiler. Everybody would be talking about it. Everyone would be talking about it. Ruff, did you hear about the new straw hat? I, it, would, it would last probably like 11 hours. I'd like wake up from a, from sleeping and be like, oh, all right. Well, I, I now know there's a new straw hat and like 400 episodes or whatever. God damn it. Oh, don't do that to me. At least wait for me to, you know, catch up. <laughs> You're a fucking liar. Oh, did he write down all of their names? That would probably be so hard to leave. Like, I know it's just a headstone, but... It's like a headstone for everybody he ever loved or cared about. Oh shit. What up, dude? Huh. Huh. <laughs> That's awesome to see. And them fighting alongside each other, they've already bonded. Like, it might just be me. Somebody correct me. I, I, obviously, like, this is on a whim. Like, if I really thought about it, maybe I'm wrong. That almost seems like the first time that somebody has just made, like, a dumb joke towards Zoro. And he didn't, like, snap back at them or, like, get annoyed. Like, he just kind of, like, smirked and nodded his head. I mean, it makes sense, I guess, right? Like, they're both swordsmen, so there's probably that, like, mutual respect and, like, them fighting alongside. Yes! Let's go! We're watching it again! Oh, my God! Fucking finally! God, it's so fucking cool. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, that's great! They even did the yo-ho-ho in there. Oh, oh, my God. I feel like I just had a heart attack. Oh god! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh damn. I mean, there is a lot of them. No, he will not marry you. No! I'm just too cool. It wouldn't work out. <laughs> I fucking love the straw hat so much. Oh my god. Fishman Island is next! You know what? I don't buy it. Y'all said that fucking last arc. Well, I guess would they really skip two arcs? Alright, so what we know, what what we know here, Fishman Island is coming at some point. Marine Ford, right, I obviously know isn't is coming at some point because people are always fucking hyping it up like, oh my god, Ralph! Like if views are gonna go up like five times when Marine Ford, blah 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 blah. And then, I don't know if it's an arc, but they talked about a place called Impel Down here, right? We know the ace is in Impel Down. So my assumption is that's probably another arc. So we're either going to Impel Down, fucking Marine Ford, or we're going to Fishman Island. I don't know which ones. I'm probably going to find out as soon as I'm done recording this and I go to click the arc to watch the episode, but let's find out. This man seen mermaids before? Bro, you better not be lying. You better not be lying, bro. If we don't see some mermaids like that, I'm gonna be fucking pissed at you. Oh, shit. Alright. Yeah, I've never heard of this. I think that's just wind. Oh, fuck. That's actually really cool. Damn, I wonder who her fucking mama is. Oh, 
Oh, yeah! Oh, my God! Oda, you fucking... You've got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. We're going to impel down. Wait, what? But he's fucked up. Well, we know where we're going. All right. I think it's safe to assume Impel Down is next unless they like bump into Fishman Island or bump into Marine Ford prior. I don't. Well, Marine Ford doesn't sound like an island. That's probably like a military base, right? I don't fucking know. I have no fucking idea, bro. They said I can't. I can't. But even listen to them. Fucking how in, in any capacity could I have possibly known after like we're going to Fishman Island. It's like. No, we're not. Very next episode. Welcome to Thriller Bark. Here's another crew member. Like, right after we got Frankie. I fucking... I, I, you just can't even fucking predict, dude. There's a million different directions it can go. I don't know. Is there is there a cry counter? Is there anybody in the community tracking that? Like, I know I cried during the Robin backstory. I know I cried here. I don't know if I cried any other times. I don't know if I, like... I don't know if I've cried prior to that. Maybe I have. We need a rough one piece cry counter. Start taking bets. How many more times I'm going to cry fucking over the next fucking two years. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, what what get on with it? What? What the fuck is what the fuck are you? Those motherfuckers are big. Okay. Whoo! All right. Got it. Damn. I guess I guess that, that kind of makes sense. Huh. Maybe I'm fucking wrong. Oh, so you'll know when it gets better. Luffy really has just become a fucking pirate. <laughs> God damn it, let's go! <laughs> Yes! Oh, fuck. That was an amazing way to end the fucking arc, dude. Holy shit. That was absolutely fantastic. That was such an emotional roller coaster. Like I said, I, I know of the three arcs, or at least I I'm pretty sure Impel Down's an arc based on, like, just context fucking clues. But I don't know what direction. I mean, I guess I, guess I could see us going to Fishman Island and then to one of the other ones. I don't know, man. But seriously, I thought I was safe. We we got so far, and I was like, nope, I, I made it. I made it, no tears. I don't know how I did it, but I made it. And then the fucking waterworks happened. And then they happened a second time. One Piece really is magic. I am I am honestly curious how many times it's been at this point, and how many times it probably will be. I'm, I'm sure that it's going to get worse. Like, at any point, if we have anything upsetting hap happen to, like, any of the Straw Hats, I, again, I feel like I'm just going to become more and more attached to them as the show goes on. So if anything bad happens to any of them, it's gonna fuck me up way more as the longer I watch the show. I can't even imagine. Like those of you who are 900 episodes deep and are watching multiple reactors do, I, I can't even imagine how emotionally attached you must be to these characters and like how how upset you must get during certain moments. Like I, I can only fucking imagine, dude. I'll get, I'll, I'm gonna get there one day. But it's insane. This really was a journey. But we are going to see what the next arc is next video. Because I'm not going to go click it until it's time. Until, until it is time for me to record the video, I'm not going to go into Crunchyroll and click the arc to get to this whatever episode is next. So I'm not going to look it up yet. It's going to be a fucking surprise. And that's my plan. So again, thank you all so much for all of the continued support. You already know what to do. Click the like button, subscribe, and turn on the bell if you are ready and ready to join this journey for more One Piece. We obviously have quite a ways before we're going to finish this. And if you want them full and uncut and early, three plus weeks early, patreon.com slash rough senpai. And if you can't afford Patreon, you can swing over to my TikTok. I do post uncut clips over there. So hopefully that helps.
Thank you all so much for the support. I really, really appreciate it. We're going to get Laboon. We're going to meet you, Laboon. One day going to happen. I'll see you all in the next One Piece video. Later.